Hello everybody, welcome to my channel once again as I bought a few items from Five Below and this will be the second item that I got. So if you haven't subscribed already, please consider subscribing down below and hit that little notification bell so you know when I'm going to be posting next. Consider hitting that like button and commenting down below. And this video is not sponsored sadly. Five Below is generally one of my favorite stores. I found out about it by watching vlogs here on YouTube from people here in California and I was like that is a really neat store. I think that's super cool that there's a store that's just five dollars and everything else is under. I know they have a five beyond now, but even the items there are not too bad. I just haven't gotten something that's ten dollars from five below yet. I know that even though like five dollars adds up quick and I get two items and it's already ten dollars, but it's two items. Anyways, basically I'm trying to get some new stuff for my setup and this is an item that I don't think I saw there before. I have yet to see this and I have always wanted to get something for this for my setup, especially with all neon. This is what I got, an LED light strip, but it's a black light, UV, UV light, and I prefer to get my LEDs from somewhere else, it's a bit more, um, what is going on? If you're trying out LEDs for the first time, and you don't really know much about it, and you don't want to invest too much money, because minimum I've had to drop like probably $20 for a really long strip, especially the one around my house, it hit like $30 on Amazon. But if you're first starting out and you want to try something real quick and something that you'd probably be able to return if it really didn't work out for you would be to go to Five Below and get one of these. They are just $5, so they're not even the Five Beyond section. They had ones, I don't know if they have the RGB ones where it's all the colors, like the ones in the back as you can see fading, fading and cycling through all the colors. But I did see they have one for red, green, and blue. And this one especially, they had black black light, UV light, and I have a lot of neon items here, and I'm going to be honest, I think it's going to be a cool, cool opportunity to have that. So here we go, these are the LED black light USB strips from Five Below, from Vi Essential, creates neon glow effect for room, accents, gaming, decorating, and much more. Let's see here. Easy to use, can be cut to fit, okay. Easy to stick on adhesive, USB powered, class 1 LED product. It is about 1 meter, so 39.37 inches in length, low energy LED lights, universal USB input, UV wavelengths, 390 to 400 nm, not sure what that stands for, please correct me in the comments. Um, and that's just the weight of it, so... Not much else on the packaging aside from the barcode, so let's just open this up. It's just a basic little package here. So that, there we go. That is okay, nothing else in there. Uh, oh, oh. Ooh, I got scared. I thought I only got the cable. I thought this was all just cable. Okay, so this is a little bit. It's because I'm used to the big rolls. Okay, okay. So this is what you get. So, okay. This is sealed. There we go. Ah, oh, I ripped the bag. My bad. So this is what you get, and I guess these are the instructions. Instructions, you see. Do not expose LED to liquid. Okay, so obviously, common sense with electricity, don't do it. Don't don't put it in water. Don't be cutting it. In, like, like, you can cut it, but make sure to be careful. Have it off. No open wires and stuff. So here is the USB part, and I guess it's just immediately connected to it. So you don't have to worry about that. And ooh, it's like a black LED strip. So one meter is around three feet. So not too bad for five bucks. And let's see how this does. And I'm going to go ahead. As you can see, previous light bar is previous video had the light bar that I reviewed right back there. Ooh, my my lighting is doing something weird on the video. The video is making it skip, but my actual LEDs aren't skipping black LED strip. We'll see how it goes in a second. And as you can see here, I don't know if it'll focus on it. Is it going to focus? Alright, that's not going to focus. But there, as you can see, there's a little white line where the copper is. That's where you cut it. When you cut it, you can then use a certain connector depending if you have those LED kits or you could solder it together. I recommend you just find a video on how to connect LEDs and like different ways if you're going to cut these. But you can cut these, but you have to cut it only here, nowhere in between, because at that point you just wasted the LED. So if you want this one, you have to cut it here and here. If you cut it anywhere there, you're just going to have to cut the whole piece off. So, I don't, there's not much of a glow. 
not too much of a glow on its own since it doesn't really light up much so let me turn this off and let me turn my other LEDs off and see how this one does with my neon items so I mean it does it does light up my items you know but it's not it is not the brightest it's not the brightest but again this is only a really small strip but the LEDs are very small so to be completely honest with you they could be a lot better they could be a lot better but I know some people are gonna say this is what happens for buying something this like cheap I'll say in price range and expecting it to do something all magical and stuff make it look like a club in here but I mean it does the job but if you're like up close it works subtly so let me keep that on my head because that's how I can angle it forward so if I turn to my other LEDs will it will it cover it up that's the question let me turn these back on hmm okay 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 Okay, they make it more vibrant. See, there's that, and then there's, and then there's that. Okay, it's something. It does help a little bit. If you want a little minimal glow, then it helps. But for somebody who's into a lot of neon, this really doesn't do the trick. If you're going to invest in like a neon light or something, I recommend just getting a bulb or those UV light, the long light bulbs or something because this works if you have a little corner maybe you have a little cabinet or something like that that you want to place and you have a few items this will work this will work if you have a small enclosed space that you want to light up like a locker or something like that this will be perfect this will be perfect it's just this much of a strip it's it's less than like wingspan that's basically it for this one. It's not terrible. It does the job. It makes things glow. It, it does what it needs to do, but it could be way better. Um, so honestly, you may need to either, they need to step it up with this, or genuinely, you might just have to invest in a, a bit more, you know? I am not completely in the know of how much UV lights cost. I've always wanted some. These, these are my, this is my first UV light aside from me going to the Scholastic Book Fair and getting those pens that are like mis mis like mystery ink or the disappearing ink or invisible ink where it has a little U UV LED at the end so I don't know I don't know the price ranges of these so let me know down, down below if you guys know more about it but I would love to have more UV lights especially with my neon items and I want to add more neon I'm going to be honest, like, it's between maybe a 2.5 or a 3. It's kind of disappointing. I, th I thought it would be brighter. At least. At least brighter. Yeah, this has been the LED, LED black like USB strip from Vibe Essential. From Five Below. It's a good starter. It's good for a small space. Maybe a cubby or a locker, or a little corner that you want to light up and the light will bounce off of each other. It will be concentrated there. But if you're lo looking to light up your setup, this will not light up your desk. That has been my review of the Vibe Essential UV light strips from Five Below. Um, oh my god, it looks like that weird, like, necklace that Thrax had from Osmosis Jones. You, got, you guys know what scene I'm talking about. I know some of you are thinking about that scene. I don't know. The c cosplay item. If anybody is cosplaying Thrax from Osmosis Jones, let me know down in the comment below if, you, if you're catching what I'm putting down. Thank you so much, you guys, for coming to my channel. Again, I'm going to stop myself before I start saying more cheesy lines. Now, please consider subscribing down below. If you haven't already, please leave a like, comment. Let me know how this video was for you guys. Thank you so much again, and I'll see you guys later. Bye.